Hey, it's Bad Aunt BB here, and thanks for tuning in. This is a hair review of a new piece that I bought from blackhairspray.com by myself. You've probably seen this all over YouTube. I know I have, and that's what inspired me to buy it. This um, is the Equal 5 Inch Lace Part, and it's definitely a lace part wig. There is no lace to cut off. It has like those fake little baby hairs in the front that mean nothing. And it's got, uh, the style is called Valentino. It's got these beautiful streaks. The color that I got is Hot Choco Lit. So this is what the tag looks like. Anywho, look at these streaks. I do believe that this is the main part of why this is so popular these colors they have a variety of colors in this wig i personally wasn't even gonna go for this one i think it was like the p27 i was trying to get um it's like uh, or some kind of p27 basically the tips of the wig it was like 1b but the tips were like 27 like a very low ombre and i just thought it was like totally natural it was something you could wear to work but also had a little bit of pizzazz, so it wasn't just your everyday wig, which is why I felt like this wig belonged in the Weekend Wig series here at the Bed on BB channel. However, I could not get that one at Black Hair Spray. It was sold out, so I got the hot chocolate, which was a blessing to get anyway, because hot chocolate is pretty much sold out on virtually every wig selling site available to us on the World Wide Web in the US of A. So I decided while it was free, I was gonna snag this one to see what the buzz is about. And I totally see what the buzz is about. These colors are beautiful. These curls for the girls are very loose, wavy. I wouldn't consider this a wave. It's definitely a curl. This is heatable up to, let's see. I wanna say 400 degrees Fahrenheit. I, I don't know where the rest of the tag is, but you can add heat to this hair, this Futura fiber. Uh, it is definitely a loose barrel curl. I've been combing mine out, so it's a wave. I definitely wore this wig this weekend, just one time. I went to a pumpkin patch with my little niece and nephew and had a blast. <laughs> It was cool outside, so I had a hat over it, which is perfect for me because I didn't straighten up this parting situation, which, let's get into that. It's definitely got that five inch deep parting situation that it did describe as having. This is definitely a lace part wig. I like to apply my powder makeup in this part right here. You can see it comes with these little fake baby hairs which just don't do justice for me as I have my own real baby hairs and it comes with some little clips for your anchor braids or your velcro your velcro no wig slip grip velcro strip however you want to pronounce that and it's got a nice little comb in the back to keep you secure and in place you want your wig to stay extra flat you take a dollop of this got to be ultra glued or whatever your got to be is of your choice you put that in the part after you part in the middle with your baby hairs right I always add some some makeup underneath the part of my wig as you all have seen in my other wig videos if not please check them out it's a great opportunity to do so if you have a little bit of time just saying all the rage <laughs> okay but yes as you can see I put my got to be glued in the part where I feel like this needs to lay flat I am holding my wig down and the only bad part about this glue in particular is that shiny residue so if you see the shiny residue you definitely want to wipe it away Hold this part down. If you have a scarf and you've got time, go ahead and tie your scarf around your part so that your wig lays really, really flat for like 
15 minutes walk around do your dishes clean your bathtub whatever it is you got to do girl just make sure your wig is flat because we don't need none of that when you step out of the house in the meantime my wig is flat enough for wig purposes right now it is definitely not going anywhere my little baby hairs are out on the side and we've got this lovely middle part you can't do anything wrong with this flow the density of this hair is very natural it is not a thick piece i'm not going to say that it is a pretty natural 100 percent to 120 percent density hair unit the unit is very lightweight um, it is Futura synthetic fiber. I wouldn't consider it that soft out of the package. Granted, this isn't the first time I, this isn't fresh out of the package, but out of the package, it wasn't the softest. The sheen is very natural. I would consider this piece, Valentino, to be extremely comparative to the Zuri Sis Hollywood wig, Olive. It gives me the same kind of wavy loose barrel pattern only been pro that this has over olive is the color selection this hot chocolate color is a beautiful array of like blonde to auburn brown it's like varieties of brown it makes it look very custom dyed i think that it is cool tone so if you are fairer skinned or white that this wig will go perfectly with your skin tone as well because it is that cooler ashy tone brown and the highlights are phenomenal it would look like you just went to a professional colorist the and the color patterns that they have if you watch some other ladies on youtube like i told you this wasn't the original color that i wanted they have so many freaking colors of this wig and so many different varieties of the wig that is its plus over a lot of other wig brands out there that i see to get the part laid on your head from then on it is a shake and go wig you can comb your hair comb them loose decide if you want it in the front side if you want it in the back put it in a ponytail in the back or a side ponytail whatever it is you want to do but it is a lace part wig i'm assuming that it's if you're buying a lace part wig you're wanting something that's quick and easy to go but also very natural looking which on camera this does photograph very nicely and you'll know that if you follow me on bad on bb on instagram because i do take some photos in this i do love it let me give y'all the turnaround you've got a good 14 16 inches layer curl i'm five foot two and yeah this is Valentino in the hot chocolate color and I'm that Aunt BB. I'm so glad y'all stuck it out with me for the weekend wig series. I hope to give you guys a lot more wig videos very soon. If you like, do give me a thumbs up, subscribe, maybe share. I'll at your girl. I love comments. I love interacting with you guys on social media. So make sure you check that out as well. Bye. Have a great weekend.